Alright fellow gamers, welcome back to another Itch.io free-to-play walkthrough. Today we have Devastated, Andrew's Dictaphone. Uh, it's supposed to be a short little point-and-click game, we'll try to figure it out real quick. My point-and-click game is not completely on point, but I've gotten better. I beat Metamorphosis or whatever it was, that was hard. Uh, we got a moon here, click it. Alright, it's not the moon, maybe we click him. This is oh. my first memory of you, Andrew. Always holding this dictaphone. What's a dictaphone? Standing there, watching me, making notes. I don't even know if this memory is real, but I think so. Hmm. After this, there is a big black hole. Nothing left. Nothing I can remember. But something must have happened. The next memory takes place after we move to the new house. I'm a baby. Oh, I'm a little baby. Ooh. Nobody is here anymore. It's only me and my memories. Okay. You told me to sit here. And then, you watched me and spoke in this weird language. I couldn't get up. For hours, I think. It definitely felt like hours. You stopped recording and put me back onto the chair when I tried to get up. And then, I waited. And you recorded. And I waited. I hate this chair. I hate that chair too. Screw that chair. Was you do the told same thing? me to sit here. Okay, I just want to see and if that happened again. Oh, I messed up. Me and spoke you can't skip through it. My language. apologies. Oh, oh, I'm not I an adult. I couldn't get up for hours, I think. Hmm. It definitely felt like hours. You stopped recording and put me back onto the chair when I tried to get up. Oh, and then oh, I me. waited. And you recorded. And I waited. I hate this chair. I'm so confused about what's going on though. How old am I now? I was a baby not too long ago. Ah, the living room. Better days. Family. Okay. You Earn. visited me and my dad more often after mom died. Who's not Andrew? only once a week, but every day very soon. I thought that was your dad. I wasn't sad because mom was dead. I was sad because you were around so often. No, Andrew's an abuser, I'm guessing. Sometimes I just stared Andrew? into the flames for minutes. Hours. I don't know. It was like a trance. And I only woke up when hearing the clicking noise of your dictaphone when you stopped recording. What in the world is a dictaphone? It's, it's a, doesn't sound good. Sounds awful. Ah, oh, the alcohol. Yes. Is that a crown? I saw bottles more and more often. Dad drank sometimes. Weird days. Alcohol. Dad homeschooled me. I think Andrew gave him money because he didn't need to get a job. He was a horrible teacher. Hmm. Unfortunate. Ah, it's this fair. This was one of the few times I left the house. We went to a fair in the city and Dad and I took a ride on the Ferris wheel. He cried while we were sitting there. Like a punk. Andrew didn't go with us. I think he was afraid of the height, but I'm not sure. But he was watching us from below all the time. What a weirdo. Who is Andrew? Is Andrew swinging or is that us? Who's swinging? Who gave you permission to swing? I can't even at click you. At the window, I often stared <laughs> at the son of a neighbor. I think he never saw me. At least I hope so. 
See me murder. Every day he went to the swing and was there for about an hour. It was like a ritual. A ritual of freedom. Freedom. So confused. Ah, knife. Now our revenge. I comes often to fantasized to stab Andrew while cooking. I wonder why I never did it. I don't know. Jail's bad. <laughs> well, you're not a murderer, I guess. Yet. Ah, oh, it's a He plate. ate less and less over the years. Hmm. I always made the food. My father was bad at cooking, and Andrew? I guess we never asked and wouldn't have. Wouldn't have asked why. Andrew sat there every day when we were eating. He never ate with us. He just recorded and we spoke in short sentences. Okay. Still don't know who Andrew is. Except a dude with phone that likes recording things. And giving people money to record things and making people alcohol. I found them one afternoon. I always wondered where he put them. It was here. That's a cool looking umbrella. My father always wore shirts. I don't know why. He had gotten them for work, but never stopped wearing them after he had stopped working. I thought he didn't work because Andrew was giving him money or something. I'm confused. I thought he went he homeschooled because he didn't have to work. Wasn't that part of the story? I'm confused. Still confused. One day, my father left me and Andrew. It was at night, and he was at my bed. At first, I thought it was Andrew, but then I realized it was him. My father. He was drunk, and he was weeping. I could barely hear what he was saying. It was so low-voiced. He told me that he loved me, but that he had to go, and I stared at him and said nothing. He went away. I did not cry. Hmm. My father's old shoes. I don't have the heart to throw them away. Uh, this is getting some weird vibes. The story has some weird vibes to it. I feel like something real bad is about to happen. Five hours after my father had left, I went to the street and it was very bright outside. I hadn't been out there for a couple of years. It was kind of surreal. <laughs> I tried to find my father. I had only a few things with me. He killed himself that night. Oh, Jesus. He did not want to come back. I became homeless and lived on the streets for a couple of months. And now, I'm back. Back, back in black, I still have the key, and it's still working. My heartbeat is very fast. Is he still here? I can't hear anything. Maybe. Maybe not. Nothing has changed. Is Andrew your imaginary friend? If he's still friend? here, he has to be in his room. What in the world is all this? I don't have a mouse, so I'm confused. Andrew oh, is still here. I didn't see him, but he is here. After all this time, still recording. And I'm back home. Andrew, I'm sorry. Can I live here again? Do you forgive me? I'm so confused. I have no idea. What is going on? Yeah, 
devastated Andrew's dictaphone. Story, idea, and sound. Daniel. I'm not gonna lie. I don't quite get it <laughs> at all. I don't know if Andrew was like an imaginary friend or like what's up with that, but there was just some dude named Andrew that was living with him apparently. And uh, I don't know, man. You know, the guess is good as mine. Maybe somebody can explain it in the comments. I don't know. I have no idea what just happened. Um, but yeah, if you like videos like these, please like and subscribe. Bye!